hello and welcome to another video uh today we'll be looking at how to trade um uh, volatility 75 index okay using two windows that's my um uh, the higher time frame window and that's the lower time frame window i have the higher time frame window as a 30 minutes time frame and i have the lower time frame window as um five minutes the higher time frame window is above okay and the lower time frame is below all right now to uh, enter trades okay uh, on the you on the upper window you allow the red line on indicator window one to cross above the blue line okay the red line on the indicator window one the ATR, uh, the moving average will cross above the ATR line, okay. And um, same thing happens on the lower time frame, which is the five minutes time frame on the ATR indicator window. Allow the red line cross above uh, the blue line to have a buy signal, okay, for you to expect to buy, okay. Of course, the upper window the crossing will happen first on the upper window or first on the higher time frame before you now look at a similar crossing on the lower time frame let's look at the uh, indicators we have for the uh, main window we have uh, fractals okay we have fractals on the main window so i have 21 period moving average shift to zero method is exponential apply to close color is red okay so this uh, red uh, moving average is very important then the higher uh, uh, period moving average is 240 which is a black line shift is zero uh, method is simple apply to close okay um, that's that for the main window for the uh, indicator window we have ATR average range period is 14 color is blue uh, the then we have um, the for, first index which is the red line period is 13 method is simple color is red uh, volumes is tick okay so the first index you will always cross above or below uh, the ATR uh, indicator which is the blue uh, line so also on the main window we can see price reacting to the red line the red line on the main window is uh, 21 period uh, moving average so when price drops like it's been highlighted when price touches the red line and then drops that gives you your sell signal okay okay uh, the for sell signal the red line must be below the black line okay uh, similar scenario happens on you allow similar scenario to happen on uh, the lower time frame where the price drops below the red line for you to have a sell signal okay uh, the other way around or conversely or on the contrary when price bounces above the red line and on the indicator window one red red line crosses above the blue line that means a false false index indicator crosses above uh, the ATR indicator then you have a buy signal okay that's on the higher time frame that you allow a repeat to happen on the lower time frame from you for you to have your trigger uh, for you to have your trigger to enter the buy uh, trade and similar uh, instance allows similar or uh, contrary instance to happen for sell signal okay the sell signal the red line will cross below uh the the red line cross below the uh blue line on the indicator window one for a uh, the higher and the lower time frames okay so that's just it uh, it's a simple strategy uh you you like it uh, you allow the uh, price to react around the red line on the main window uh, 
okay and then you allow crossing to happen on indicator wheel one now for the to divide the uh to divide the windows into two you go for the uh, window icon as highlighted that's the window icon above your chart okay if you click on it you will have a pop-up window okay you have a pop-up window for charts okay so you can uh, create an additional uh, window on mt5 i have 30 minutes uh, time frame but at least it's on five index as the upper window and i have five minutes time frame well at least it's on five index as the uh, lower window so that's how you can divide uh, your the screen into two okay then you use then you set up the indicators like i have explained earlier uh, you set it up for the upper window which is the 30 minutes uh, time frame you also set it up for the lower window which is the five minutes time frame okay you can use 30 minutes and five minutes you can use one minute and uh, uh, 15 minutes you can use uh, 30 minutes and uh, four hours you can use one hour and then um, and the uh, daily time frame okay just allow the allowance of one time frame between the two windows for this example 15 minutes time frame is skipped so from 5 to 30 minutes so it allows us to have an alignment okay and as you can see price is about going up i place the buy trade because the red line on the upper time frame the higher time frame has already crossed above the blue on indicator window one and we are, i'm having the similar uh, instance on the lower time frame indicator window one red line has crossed above so i expect price to go up okay I expect price to go up for this particular example all right so that's that um uh, just for sell signal just allow price to react downward against the red line for buy signal allow price to react upward against the red line okay and then you look for the crossover on the indicator window one okay that's for the higher time frame you allow a repeat you wait patiently for a repeat to happen on the lower time frame okay so that's basically how this um, strategy works don't forget to subscribe to our channel click the subscribe button so that you get to see more uh, videos on more strategies and how to trade forex and volatility index okay don't forget to click the like button like the video click the like button okay click the um, uh, bell button below the video for notification Click the bell button below the video for notification all right also drop your comments ask questions if you're not clear with any part of the video uh, you can visit our website www.binfxtrader.com and another website of us fxfables.com to learn more on how to trade forex and volatility index till i come your way next time it's bye for now